Want to head out now to Way 31's Will Robinson Smith. He joins us live in Huntsville and has been monitoring the situation there. Will, what's the latest where you're at? Hey, Naja. So we're in the northern Madison County area. We're in the Moores Mill area. At this point, the, the rain started picking up about 10 or so minutes ago. Want to sweep you out to the roads right here. You can see they're starting to get slick still. A little bit of traffic on the road at this point that you can see here right now, but roads are, are still passable. And you know, we talked with the Moores Mill Volunteer Fire Department. They're the ones uh, whose property the storm shelter is on right here. And they said that um, you know they're keeping a close eye on conditions around here. They've already had to respond, as we reported earlier this morning, a structure that was hit by a lightning strike that caused a fire. So they've already had a busy day today, but so far they've, they're keeping the storm shelter open for anyone who might need it. As of right now, there's only one family who lives out of town. They said they wanted to get here before things got too bad, make sure that uh, she and her child were hunkered down as well as their cat. So taking those precautions and they also made sure to bring a mask with them. That's something that if you are going to take advantage of a storm shelter, emergency crews are asking you to be vigilant of. Now, about an hour and a half ago, there was a meeting with the Huntsville Madison County Emergency Management Agency, along with other leaders here in the county, taking another briefing on what the weather situation is like. And they're keeping a track on the warm front that we've been watching for you throughout the day and throughout the week, as that's sitting to our south right now. They're keeping a close eye on that, as well as what's happening to our south and to our west in counties like Morgan County and Lawrence County, watching what's happening there to see if they need to activate the EMA if it starts to look bad there, so that they have people. People in place to make sure everyone is aware here. We're now reporting live in Madison County. Will Robinson Smith, Way 31 News.